Well, I've got my Van Wert VA600 boiler finally. I had to go up to Moscow, PA yesterday and pick it up. It was in a basement, so it was a lot of fun. We got it out in a couple of hours with help from my buddy Joe. Right now, I got it set up for a pressure test. This one was pulled out because it was diagnosed as having the domestic water coil was leaking into the boiler causing the pressure relief valve to pop. Typical house water pressures, 50 to 60 PSI and the uh, boiler only wants to see maximum of 30 PSI in it. The pressure relief valve set at 30. So the homeowner wasn't happy about that so they yanked this really really nice Van Wert VA600 with with the oil burner option, that's what that hole in the side there is, and put in a new oil boiler. So, got everything all sealed up right now. Just starting to fill it up with some water for a pressure test. There's the tag. It says it's uh, National board number 5167 has the H stamp there. Certified by Den Dencon Products. Max steam pressure is 15, max water pressure is 30 psi. And this is interesting. It says heat surface 24.5. Year 87. So this is a very late Van Wert VA600. It's, uh, I guess, a 1987 model. When I got it home, luckily I had this to protect what I had in the front of the boiler here. I had the uh, this three-quarter inch piece of pipe still in it. And being silly, I just backed the truck right into the uh, garage, not realizing that that sticks up too high. And now I've got a nice dent in my uh, garage door frame here, but luckily this was here because this broke <laughs> and kind of saved everything else and just dented the, the finish. Oh, all right, we'll finish filling this boiler up. I've got a gauge in the top here as well as the boiler gauge. And we'll see if it holds pressure. I'm going to kind of do a reverse domestic coil pressure test since they diagnosed it as this coil leaking theoretically with these open and the boiler pressurized if it is leaking water should come out these two connections here so I'm not 100% sure if they were correct with the diagnosis of the domestic coil it may have, it could have also been the automatic water feed. If that was leaking, that will cause the boiler to go over pressure too, because the house pressure has that kind of way to get in. All right, well, we'll pressure it up and see what we got.